Here we are going to discuss a proof which is based on the properties of parallel lines. In the figure below, PQ parallel SR and PS parallel QR prove that angle PSR is equal to angle PQR. So here we are given that PQ is parallel to SR and PS is parallel to QR. We have to prove that angle PSR is equal to angle PQR. Here points P, Q, R and S are the intersection points of the respective lines. When we consider AB and CD as the parallel lines, then PS and QR can be considered as the transversals. And when we consider PS and QR as the parallel lines, AB and CD can be considered the transversals. Let's now discuss the approach for proving this. Approach for proving this will be, here angle APS and angle PSR are alternate angles. So these two angles are equal and also angle APS and angle PQR are corresponding angles so these two angles are also equal so this angle is equal to this angle and this angle is also equal to this angle that means these two angles are equal to each other also so we can write angle APS is equal to angle PSR because these are alternate angles and we can call this as 1 also angle APS is equal to angle PQR because these are corresponding angles, we can call this as 2. From 1 and 2, we can have this implies that angle PSR is equal to angle PQR. And this is what we have to prove in this proof. Let's summarize what we have learned from this proof. Two pairs of parallel lines, that means PQ and SR and QR and PS form a parallelogram PQRS. We have proved in this proof that angle PSR is equal to angle PQR using the properties of parallel lines. This is one of the important properties of parallelograms you might have learnt about this in the properties of parallelograms.